the Alas Pilipinas women's team is going all out in their preparations to represent the country on home soil. And of course, joining us tonight to talk about the national squad are, of course, your volleyball analysts, Ayel Estraniero and Phil Kainglet Cayetano. Ladies, Hello. good evening. Back, back to the show. Back. All right, well, of course, let's go back to that first uh, video that we uh -huh. saw. You know, Gia Morado de Guzman, as well as uh, Don Makandili Katindi. Yes, both <laughs> isolated <laughs> and both having new roles yeah. in this new um, uh, uh, national team lineup. Now they are at this. What do we see, you know, this uh, year? Yeah, let's talk them? about Gia first yeah. and what yeah. she yeah. said, Phil. Of course, first, I'm happy that Gia is in the position and the circumstance that she can mentor now. Mm. Mm. Like, in any um, athlete's dream or parang for any athlete, it's just fulfilling to be able to mentor the mm -hmm. um, younger ones. Because before they were the rookies, you said, <laughs> and now they're the athletes, they're the mentors, they're the yeah. one to you know um, teach the <clears throat> um, the young ones, especially Julia Corner is a rookie somehow, and knowing that Gia has the experience from Japan, the champion mm -hmm. um, champion league there, she just came home and she can really mentor all the players and mm. knowing Gia she has the leadership I work with her I, I love was going her. to say yeah, I love yeah. working well, what's your experience yeah, I love her. working mm. her, with her she's very open like yeah. I can approach her I can openly tell her wait mm. <laughs> you know? yeah. she's very open and she won't take it against me or like she won't like attitude mm -hmm. <laughs> set her. she's very open very professional and happy that she has this chance to be the team captain actually yes. in this national team so I'm proud of her and I can't mm. wait to watch her. Yeah, it's oh. such a great honor for us to watch mm. her, for her to lead this team and for her to come back watching yes. her team, mm. team win a championship so she's on a high yeah, also, yes. right? And that great experience uh, in Japan. Which brings me to you, uh, Ayel. Um, you, you've had experience with you know, training in Japan. Mm -hmm. She obviously has yeah. uh, experience playing in Japan and she says the one thing that she really loves most about the Japan system is they keep it yeah. simple. Mm -hmm. Okay, tell us about uh, what, what she says and what that will bring to this Alas team. I, I think just to add on to what uh, Atifil said about Gia having a big opportunity to mentor um, the younger ones. Yeah. And I think she's, we're very excited for her, but I think sobrang excited niya din because she, may baon siya eh. Mm -hmm. Meron siyang very important and parang new um, experience and learning that uh, she can share to the younger generation of mm -hmm. players. And not just that, I think um, what you mentioned, keeping it simple, I think Gia has always been that kind of player. You know, that's a Kaya great, point. Parang, great point. W w when you look at her, parang, it's just Gia. I'm, I mean, it's a new role, but it's something she has embodied and embraced for the longest time. Mm -hmm. And in a fan perspective, mm -hmm. and for someone who uh, haven't really played with Gia, I'm very excited to see how she will lead the younger ones. Yeah. And uh, in situations na alam mo yun, may pressure, because mm -hmm. we haven't yeah. seen her yeah. play yeah. with the locals for quite some time. Right. Mm -hmm. Seen her before she had an international experience. Mm -hmm. But Correct. now this is the first time we're gonna see her play mm. after that, you know, all of what she achieved in, in Japan. So, so I'm pretty sure despite all the mga G amazing yes, movement, yes. we're gonna see something Which, yeah. we're, we're gonna see something new from her. Which yeah, are never sure. flashy. She, yes. That's the thing. Is, Again, it's G amazing, yeah. yeah. We're yeah. never flashy, mm -hmm. but they are amazing. And I think just to jump on that and, and Z tell us also. Keeping it simple is what we need yeah. for yes. the lack of preparation right. of the team. Yes, right? I mean, up until now, it's very interesting uh, to see so many talents mm -hmm. um, coming from different systems, yeah. coming from different universities. But, you know, iba yung vibe that I'm getting now. Now, everyone's just like yeah. happy to be yeah. here. Right? One is everyone's just happy to mm -hmm. be here. Two is like everyone's just so excited to mm -hmm. work with each yeah. other. Right. And three, just happy to be representing mm -hmm. Philippines in another yeah. opportunity. Okay, Don Makandili naman. Uh, oh, wow, I mean, what a luxury, obviously, uh, that you have Dawn as the... Uh, yes. I'm sure Gia is very happy <laughs> about that, too. What does she bring to the table for, for uh, Team Pilipinas, Alas Pilipinas, knowing that she's already been a multi-awarded yes. yes. libero? And so she's also an experienced player. I watched Correct. her yeah. during the SEA Games yes. in 2019, and she yes. was... One of on Asia's point. best, Yes, right? and yes. she was, like, Ooh. diving across yeah. the A-board. I was right. like, oh! Yeah, so for Dawn Makanili to be there in a defense, and one of the seniors... 
in the team Correct. that could help Gia also. Aside from setter, isa lang yung setter eh. And isa, yung libero is also one role inside the court. So the leadership of Dawn is also important. Now she can, she said nga in her interview, the girls there mm -hmm. yeah. are very coachable. And I yeah. can feel that yung mga players right now, aside from being happy there, they're driven to get the job yes. done. And for Dawn, nandun yung, she's in the, her highest peak right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I can say, I've been saying that she's the fittest. She's in her fittest era right now mm. and I feel like that can be inspirations for everyone right. to see her right. as an example yeah, yeah. yeah. example right. for the young ones now she's taking care of her body they can see her taking care of her body and how she moves in the court it's mm -hmm. like high level yeah. mm. she throws herself in the court oh, so yes. you know that what sacrifice she team. does to her body it yeah. can be an example for the girls very interesting lineup and you've already yeah. mentioned two players <laughs> but uh, yeah, it, yeah let's talk about the team lineup so far we have 13 mm -hmm. names on the list what can we say about first impression of the list yeah. it for me it's so refreshing yeah sobrang refreshing to see um new names yeah but very talented players yes like you mentioned it earlier na players na gigil like yung fighting spirit and don talaga and mm -hmm. i think given the short preparation they're mm -hmm. the perfect fit for the role mm -hmm. na na players this composition of players yeah and mm -hmm. uh, well it's exciting because it's very young we're used to having to seeing you mga seniors the veterans, veterans. The veterans. Beca yeah. because we have this yun nga um, i guess concern issue problem whatever yeah. word you want to use in times like these now we have to put a team together yeah. right away so na sa sanay tayo na puro veterano yeah. yung napapadala yeah. natin and, that's your point yeah right? and I think this is helpful for, for the long term program of right. the national team sabi nga ni Gia they're diba? looking for long term looking forward yeah. looking, looking long term kasi nga bata pa eh and yeah. the, you, you, longevity is not even an issue right now because mm. yeah. they have yeah. really long yeah. long way for their career and it's mm. uh, AVC I think is a really good experience as, as, as a start of you know a league for this very young lineup. Yeah. What, what a mix of uh, talent. Of course, uh, dapat pa nga, as, as I'm sure some people know, Belen was gonna be there. Mm -hmm. Solon, yes. yeah. Solomon, uh, uh, Don Galio, who was such an incredible talent. Well, what an experience, Sana, for them. But injuries and other, uh, pri uh, I wouldn't want to say priorities, but other things that they have to attend mm -hmm. to uh, got in the way. But regardless, yes. I mean, uh, uh, the combination of talent. So. Lahat ng team, Phil, you're a veteran in the sport of volleyball, as the, you three are. Lahat ng team may personality. Yes. May, mm -hmm. What do you think will be the personality of this team? Knowing the kind of talent, mm -hmm. Gia, Don, Cece, yes. Ea, Vanny, Cherry, mm -hmm. Faith, Fifi, Jen, Del, mm -hmm. Julia, as you mentioned, Canino, Gagate. Yes. Yeah. What, what are you seeing? I'm actually happy with this lineup. I think generally everyone in the community is mm -hmm. happy with this lineup. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I feel like the personality of this team is gonna be driven. Mm -hmm. And like, no problems with chemistry. Because mm -hmm. everyone wants to get you the think, job huh? done. Think, yeah, because oh, okay. I think there's no problem in the chemistry because they have all their talents. It's up to the coach, actually, all mm -hmm. the technicals. It's the chance for the coach to like, um, make the best first six or the lineup to shuffle yeah. it's their challenge and for the girls you know they're all talented and we're tall we have tall players yeah. and that's a plus for us you know if yeah. I'm gonna make my first six una ko lahat na matangka just to <laughs> the, yeah, the opponent because <laughs> yeah, they don't know our team bago na naman yeah, eh. yeah, so yeah. I feel like this team is gonna be driven and we're gonna be proud of them and they're gonna bring us they don't pro they, they won't promise any wins because it's just the beginning Correct. but I feel like it's gonna be a strong foundation mm. for the national team uh, uh, from uh, okay that's the yung driven personality yeah. oh. From a style of volleyball, yeah. naman, anong nakikita mo? I feel like we have a chance of, you know, prioritizing. Sabi mo na kasi tole, eh, diba? I feel like there's a good mix of speed and length right now. Okay. Because their That's leader, good. their setter is Gia Morad de Guzman, mm -hmm. who's so used with playing fast volleyball. Mm -hmm. But then yes. she has the luxury of having the heights of Tia Gagate, Del Palomata, right. um, Fifi Sharma, mm -hmm. and then the wing attackers, na Angel Canino, Canino Ea Laura. So there's height, but there's also speed. Mm -hmm. So it's. I wouldn't say it's the first time, but it's interesting how Gia will actually play mm -hmm. with different talents yeah. on the yeah. court. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, yeah. we're so used to the exactly, team line right? yeah. or the Ateneo. Yeah. And yeah. all like, 
How will even she, the personalities right? of players pareho. How will diba? she maximize the height of Thea Gagate yeah. or the speed of Fifi Sharma or like the length of Angel Canino as a wing. So, medyo dun ako very nice. interested. Kasi, mga back row attacks. Oh, yeah. 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 And then, Bani Gandler yung Bani, back row niya. Yes. Diba? Yung, yung ganun. And it, it's so exciting kasi it's Gia leading the pack. Yeah. Mm. How do we feel um, about, you know, yun nga, balikan natin na ang daming bagong, uh, it's a new group, and it, it, they're coming from different systems, different coaches, different schools. Like, how do you see this as a plus for this uh, lineup mm, to the, uh, this kakaiba. year? Kakaiba. Okay, so, pero, you know, it's yeah. it's about, you know, bringing it together. I think Don said it in the interview that yeah. Coach Jorge doesn't want to change how right. they play, right. but yeah. like, he wants to enhance, he wants to like, make them perform their full capacity yeah. and mm-hmm. I feel like alam mo may mga tendency yung iba pero I feel like everyone's willing to work and mm-hmm. adjust to whatever system's gonna be in their team the national team the alas here's a fun thing we have time <laughs> what are what are we looking at in terms of the starting six here oh. if we were to guess <laughs> lang you know if we were to kumbaga <laughs> Your preference. Yeah. This is nothing mm-hmm. official, or it's not yeah. you know, a suggestion. Yes. But I'm okay. I know, well, hey, Mithaya Gagate, yeah. what, what are you what, looking at? My dream at? team, Ayan, yeah. Yeah, starting yeah, lineup diba? would be, diba? of course, Gia Morado. Oh, of course, captain. of course. Right. And then for Libero, I would make Jen Yerba receive and mm. Don to defend. Unahin ko yung dalong matangkad, si Gagate, tsaka si Palumata, first six ko. And I'm confused because lahat ng players nandun, open yeah. spikers. Yeah. So in the video, I saw mm, um, right. Kanino was being opposite, which is also good because she can do a back row and she can block. She's Correct. tall. Correct. So Kanino is the opposite. And then outside hitter, ko, I see um, si, si Rondina uh, and right. Aya. Si Aya. 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 Mm. I want, I want na first six ko si, uh, open si Aya and si, Fe, si ano, Faith. Because I want to insert CC pang spark plug. Because I know she can do it. Ah. As a veteran, pag pinasok mo yan, sure yes. pupuntos. Yes. Ah, kumbaga hindi yes. na kailangan na yung from up. the start. Oh. Ganon. Which, by the way, was her old role in UST yeah. before yeah. she became yeah. an MVP. Yeah. Yeah. Ayal, we have a minute. So what do you think? What do you think? <laughs> um, For me, I agree with Same. with Gia, with uh, Jen, with um, Don. Jen and Dawn na salitan. Because okay. he mentioned it earlier. It's a, it's a yeah. short tournament. Every day sila yep. maglalaro. So, right. you want to really also parang Shop ayaw mo masyadong mapagod yung isang player right. in just one game. Right, so, you right, want right. to manage the load properly. Right, right. But I would say, I would really put CC first. Because okay. I, I would say, kailangan nila ng explosive player like, okay. right away. Yeah. Na veteran. Okay. Yeah. Na whenever they need a point, si Gia meron siyang isang player, pupuntahan ko to. Right. Given that Out they're of system, all... Out system. Right? Yes. Yes. Given na oh, oh, bata, <laughs> although a lot of them... Has, That's a great um, point. A lot of them has a junior national team experience. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Pero iba pa rin yung senior, iba yung pressure. So, yes. It, yeah. it would be nice having that one player na safety net ni Gia na I need a point, I can go to this game. Spoken like a true mm. setter. I <laughs> yes, exactly. All right, we're going up against Australia first, India, Iran, Chinese Taipei. That's the 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th. That will wow. be the schedule. Oh, we're all excited just to see them play. We temper our expectations just like the players are. But that will not take away the excitement of seeing them play together. Supportan natin yan, alas Filipino.